Hello everyone watching Celebrity Chat, please, like, share and subscribe. All about Adam Schulman, Anne Hathaway's husband and father of her two children. From her breakout role as Princess Mia Thermopolis in 2001's The Princess Diaries to her Oscar-winning performance as Fantine in 2012's Les Miserables, Anne Hathaway has been a household name in Hollywood for decades. But Hathaway has made a point to keep her personal life private including her nine-year marriage to Adam Schulman. Hathaway surprised fans when she exchanged vows with Schulman, then her boyfriend of four years, in a private Big Sur California, ceremony back in September 2012. She was just 29 then. Now, nine years and two children later, the couple remains strong, committed, and largely out of the spotlight. So who is Hathaway's longtime partner? From Schulman's career to his history with Hathaway, here is everything you need to know about the man who stole the actress's heart. Hathaway sensed she'd marry Schulman when she first met him. Schulman and Hathaway met at the Palm Springs Film Festival in 2008. Hathaway later told Harper's Bazaar UK in its February 2013 cover story that she told a mutual friend of theirs at the time, I'm going to marry that man. I think he thought I was a little nuts, which I am a bit, but I'm also nice. When asked if she faced any trust issues when they first started dating, Hathaway's last ex Raffaello Foliari had been arrested for fraud, Hathaway was honest with the British publication. She said, I was just very honest with him. I knew from the second I met him that he was the love of my life. I also knew that I couldn't have met him at a worse time. I took my trust out for a ridiculous joyride with him. I told him I believe, because I need to believe, that what just happened to me was the exception and not the rule, and that people are good and you are a good person, because I feel it. And so I am not in a good place right now, but I'm going with this. And he has never hurt me. And I was right. It was scary. But as the days wore on it kept on getting better and better. I found that the love I found for him made me more trusting of everyone, and the more I started to see who I had become. I had lost track of myself during those years and I actually started to see who I had become and that's, that's when things got tricky and ugly. Having to forgive myself. The couple tied the knot in a low-key ceremony. Hathaway and Shulman had a very California wedding weekend. According to People, more than 150 guests were invited to Big Sur in September 2012. The celebration started Friday, with a rehearsal dinner at the Ventana Inn and Spa. The ceremony took place in a nearby estate. As far as decor goes, the couple kept it classy and rustic, with decor inspired by nature, a source told People. Thanks for watching Celebrity Chat News. Please if you like the video share and subscribe for the latest updates.